Hi, this is JT Wisdom, and I hope you're having a wonderful day. This is another Dooney and Burke Discovery video. And I wanted to uh, get a little vintage. Uh, and I wanted to uh, talk about... I never talked about this bag on a video. And it's it's uh, this bag is called the... It's the Dooney and Burke. Sophie is her name. So it's Sophie European Leather Hobo Handbag. And it's from, it was from the Seville family. And this bag, uh, I purchased this bag as a today's special uh, in 2014. And I never did a, I never did a video on this bag. And I really, this is one of my, one of my favorite bags. I really like the softness. I really like the softness of it. Uh, the little um, tabs on the end. There, I have to work those out. I've had the, you know, like how when you actually put up your bags and when you bring them out, you kind of have to fluff them out again. But it has, uh, it's the color is orchid. Uh, I I looked on QVC and they do not carry this bag anymore. And uh, so I just wanted to, I wanted to share it with you because I thought it was such a pretty bag. But they don't carry it on QVC anymore, and I don't know if they carry it in any other outlets uh they may have it on ebay i don't know if they'll have it in this color but if you really like the bag uh, uh if you do some research you may get you may get a really good deal on it but i got it as a today's special in 2014 and what i really liked about it is that the the straps or the straps are adjustable and if you notice the straps are the same color as the handbag the handbag is really soft I mean it's soft as a hug I mean it's just if you feel you can do feel the vision you can see how soft the, the handbag is the strap adjusts to 12 adjust to 12 to 14 inches um, this was I had it in the, the strap in this first notch when I got it and I still have it in that notch I really like it the uh, the there's a four inch depth in the handbag and the bag measures 12 by 12 uh, you notice it's a two-tone the the tassels are very soft the the uh, bottom of the bag is a is a dark dark black and then it cross with the it's orchid but it almost looks like a fuchsia pink kind of like a, it looks like a fuchsia pink and the nameplate has the uh, the gold Dunian Burke nameplate 1975 and then there's also the brass uh, hardware on on the uh, on the uh, straps and you can see it is uh, open opens uh, open the strap of the handbag with the tassels it's very sturdy and strong so you don't feel like anything's falling apart one of the cool things I like about this too is that like when I'm at work if I need to show my ID or anything I can just there's another zipper in the back and it's a nice roomy back zippered uh, compartment where I can keep my ID and, and uh, keys and it has the same coloring as the bottom of the handbag. Uh, there's also like a luggage name plate, uh, uh, kind of leather luggage tag that has the Dooney and Berg logo on there. And when you when I open the bag, there's a surprise in here. Actually has a matching. I mean, look at this, it's a matching wallet. It came with a matching wallet, so it's the same two tone coloring as the wall as the handbag and you notice you could put in if you want to put in your credit cards or anything like that if you wanted to put in uh like bills you know like uh, dollar bills or put your money in there or anything like that for lunch or whatever you can i use this for my big six plus iphone it fits great and it has that snap compartment so this is kind of what it looks like together I'll zip it up right here and show you. That's kind of what it looks like together, which is it's really nice. And the bag is just really, really soft, really soft bag. And 
once I open up the bag, I'll show you, give you a tour here. There is a space here where, uh, and also if you notice, I wanted to, before I talk about the tour of the bag, inside of the bag, this actually is a different method. This is actually coated cotton. This was when I first got the bag, I noticed how different that was because when you, because they did a, they did something different. They actually have, I'm going to take my phone out of here, out of the wallet. If you notice, the the wallet is has a interior lining of cotton. You can if you can hear that it has interior cotton, but the handbag actually has it almost looks like leather, but actually it's coated cotton. So they did it in two different mediums. If you can see that, so you can see there's leather on the insets here, but this the red part is coated cotton. So there's the. Dooneyberg logo. There's a zipper here on the inside. Nice roomy, real roomy zipper. I can put my whole hand in there. Then there's another compartment here where if you want to put your phone or your business cards. I put my trusty purse caddy in there. I have my uh, my eyeglass case. And uh, this is the uh, the uh, uh, you know the key key what I put my keychain on and everything and it's in it's webbing it's a webbing on there and then I put my purse caddy in there and then as I turn the bag around you'll see that there's two compartments here where if I wanted to put my eyeglass case in there I could or if I wanted to put like some my shades or something like that in there I could so it's a real roomy bag uh, so and I have another eyeglass case in here too so yeah I could put that in there and just put that in there or I can put it in this one either or and everything once I put my iPhone in here and then it snaps you can hear that snap and you snap it here snap and then I put that back in I mean, this is another another purse that actually has would stay special. Which, you know, if you go to Macy's or any place like that, or any department store, nine times out of ten, you're not going to be getting an extra wallet with the handbag, which is nice. And as I zip that up, then you notice it's a really, really nice handbag. Uh, the only thing I notice is that. When I put up my handbags, I just have to kind of tame them a little bit as far as the end straps. The little end straps goes on the end, but other than that, I really, really like this bag. It's really, really a really nice, soft, real soft bag. And also, there's feet. So I really like this. See, there's nice, there's feet underneath here. So you know that when you're sitting your bag down, you know that you're sitting it down and you're not sitting your leather on, you know, whether it's the floor or wherever you're sitting your bag. Um, I really, you know, I know you don't like sitting your bag on the floor. Sometimes you have to sit your bag on the floor, but if you don't have to, but if you do have to sit your bag down, you know for sure that you have feet on your bag, but also you know that you can always wipe that off too. You can wipe that off as well as the leather part of the bag. But I wanted to let you know that it, it also had feet on the bottom as well. I'm gonna stand up, stand up, so I can kind of show you what it looks like. So it's really a nice bag, really a soft bag. Uh, but um, they do not carry it on QVC, and I don't know why, because it was it's really was a really popular bag. But they don't carry it anymore, but I'm, they may have it on eBay. They may have it in different colors. But if you have this bag, let me know because they don't carry it anymore. So um, I wanted to share that with you, how this bag looks. And I wanted to also share, like, you see how when I have it over my shoulder, how there's a lot of room right there and how it puddles really nicely. And I really like that. Uh, so if I have on a coat... Or anything like that it goes real well or if I want to carry it like this I can carry it like that as well too but it's a really really nice really nice bag and I I just wanted to share that with you so uh, until next time I just wanted to let you know that 
a lot of times bags are exclusive so sometimes when you see that that good deal as either a today's special or something like that if you can grab it because it's not available now it's not available now it came in other colors too but um, I wanted to share this color and share the bag that I got and just wanted to let you take a look at it and see how it looks so uh, until next time this is JT Wisdom and Jesus is Lord